build this bridge. Let's see. Get on the log. All right, looking good. Let's go grab us a stack of planks. Yep, I know. I know it's ugly, guys. I don't have the foliage on because um, I want to be able to see what I'm doing. For anybody who's just joining us. This is experimental bridge number one. Alright, so once we get the foundation down, then we're going to put a wall on it. I hope. Oh, come on. Come come on. Okay, sweet. So I can go there. Let's take a let's build both templates so we can take a look. And they're way too high. Dang it. I think that no. If I because if I go if I level out here, I just don't know. Where's my cart? Because I want to try to make it as level as I can for both sides. So by the time we get to the land here, we can just build stairs, like the the ramp stairs. Let's pop up. And that is a hill, so we can. I guess we're gonna have to build one verse piece and just see how it works. Where are you at, bear? I hear you screaming. Are you in the water? Oh, yep, he's in the water. No! Get away from me! I'm working on a project, Bear. I don't need you disturbing me right now. Anytime you want to build something intense, it's like <laughs> bears come out of the woodwork. Okay, so for the wall, what else do we need? Should just be three wood and four planks. Alright, then we're going to delete this one. And we'll do the wood ceiling piece. Oh yeah, I can't lay them all out. Uh, so I guess I'm going to have to just build this whole thing and hope for the best. I definitely think I'm on the right track. I just don't know how well it's going to work. Wait, can we? I don't know if I can attach a wood ramp to this though. Huh. I think this is going to take a lot of trial by error. <laughs> it's just got to build a lot of a lot of bridges until I get them the, the way I want them. Two iron ore, I'll take that. Okay, so the moment of truth, I don't think I can build a ramp off that now that I'm trying. I cannot. And if I build another one of those, I bet it won't go flush. It will not. Now what if I tried to do 
Get out of here. Can I eyeball a foundation to where it looks like it's made to it? Well, it's not. A little bit, a little bit. Yep, yep. Something like that. Oh, yeah, I can live with that. Building bridges. Now what do we need? We're hurting for something. We need water. Papa saved just because I so far I like the way this is going. Hopefully it lands on that side pretty well. And we need some more planks. It's like a I guess a smart man would take a load of lumber back over there. Wait, no he wouldn't. Because I want to get all the planks. Because you have to empty the saws to move them. And to build this bridge I'm definitely going to want the saws to be sitting pretty much on that foundation once it's complete. Use these up so that one will be empty. I think that's going to be a good looking bridge once I get it finished. Yes, yes, that's it's mighty close to perfect. That's good enough for me. <laughs> I'm going to zoom, rebuild that a hundred times. Alright, so from here we can build the wooden ramp. And now we'll have a functioning bridge started. Alright, so we can just walk up here. Now we can take the log cart across as we go. Everybody say a prayer that this is going to land at the right height. I can't tell. Turn the flashlight on because it's getting dark. Oh, don't tilt up on me like that. Bet I'm gonna wish I built it a little bit farther to the to my right because I'm facing the other bank. Worst case, maybe I can use this one as a, like a placeholder to build one that's more level. Right, so we're just going to continue doing this until we get all the way across the river. And then if I have to rebuild it, I'll probably do that at a later time. I don't like when the log cart does this. It, it does this sometimes when you go up, up and down stairs. And it doesn't want you to put it back down. Right, we'll just back it up. And now it's doing this. Okay. There we go. You just got to trick it, make it level again. Alright, so on the last section over here, we went ahead and put down a new foundation. So we can try to build some stairs up to it. A little bit of a gap, but you can't hardly notice it.
And there we go. Stairs perfect. Need one more. Is that axe on me? Yes. And we'll just leave these over here. And our bridge is done. Well, it's not done, but it's built. And that is Bridge Building 101. <laughs> I'm glad that first one worked out properly. Now I just need to build, like, what, two more? And then I can get to either side of the river. Like I said, you could, for anybody who doesn't want to build or try to get another bridge to level out like this, you could just build more of these wooden ceilings and you can just run off the side. It's just not, it's not going to look as nice. But that will be how you get that, get it built. Um, like I said, I, so what I did was I dropped a foundation under the water here. And then I built a wall off of it. And then built a ceiling off of that. And you just have to eyeball it and rebuild it if you don't get it just right. And then you just build the wood ceiling out. It won't attach to a foundation, so you kind of have to eyeball that and just lay it down. And then you can attach stairs to that, and that'll give you a full run of a bridge. And then what I'm going to do next after this, I'll probably, I might go ahead and do it just so I can get, because it'll, it'll look good, is I'll probably put railings down both sides. And you can make it too wide too if you wanted to. That's tempting. It's just, it's going to take so many materials to do that. But I'll probably run railings down it and then put some posts in if it'll let me. And then put like a, a single roof all the way down. And that's going to take, I don't know, like 50 clay or something. But I believe that's what we'll do. And then my village would be looking super nice. Alright guys, welcome back. Um, so we're, we finished the bridge finally. Um, as you can tell, it took a lot of clay and a ton of wood and planks. I think it came out pretty nice. I plan to build a few more. Uh, I'm currently located, like I said, on this peninsula here. So I plan to come off each side at least, so at least two more bridges need to be built. Uh, currently right now, uh, like I said, the bridge is pretty pretty good like you have to like force this foundation in like I said earlier and but everything else lined up really nice so like we just run down it just looks like an endless <laughs> endless waltz I guess I do plan to add some more lighting to it or not some more but some lighting to it I just don't have the ingots down here right now and uh, yeah so this bridge you know just goes across like the I didn't realize it, but like the widest part of the river. And leads back over here to my village that I've built. Now, yeah, I know foliage is off right now, guys. I was farming a bunch of clay. But yeah, here's one of our big houses we've built so far. I haven't added anything to the inside of this one yet. Just some like, I mean, there's bedrooms and stuff on each house. And then we have a kitchen with the pantry in it. All the windows are fully built. I have like a common area here for cooking and eating is what it's going to be, I guess, it's turning into. Um, that's just a lumber mill. And yeah, I, these I keep moving around just to uh, build buildings faster. But this one's fully stocked and ready to go. These are what you need to be using though. Like, don't keep using the old ones. Use these new ones. They're a lot faster, a lot better. And then if we go in this building here, this will be the forge. Like I said, I'm still adding stuff to the interiors, so. We've got 18 forges. Uh, this is the second house that I built. Put an L-shaped porch on it. So living room, you know, back porch with the back door going out to the river. Would it be a kitchen? And 
and two bedrooms into in here. As y'all know, we don't have a lot of furniture, so there's not really a lot I can put in here. And so, yeah, this was the second one. That was the third one, the larger house. I built the forge fourth. And as you can see, I've been trying to change the exteriors and the roof lines and stuff just to make the buildings stand out and look different. And this was the first one. I had some Bambi smash this part down. I'll have to rebuild that as they come in to try to destroy the rest of it. But there she is. So we'll just waltz into here. This one's actually got some stuff into it. Like a forge to kind of look like a chimney. Uh, I've started a stove and a fridge. Food prep table. Weapons rack just for, it's like the only decoration we have. You know, like a tub. This would be like a bathroom area, I guess. And then a single bedroom. And this is house number one. Just to show some of the different ways you can build things to make your houses or your bases stand out. I'm starting something over there. I'm not really sure if I'm going to build it or what I'm going to do with that yet. And uh, yeah, I think, and then we have this one more building up here that just ended up being like a giant block. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with it yet. And my old refiner just sitting up right there because there's not like a lot of level ground here to work with. Like I said, I'm over here by the Crocs. So what I did here was I just built a foundation as close to the ground as I could to get the most space I could out of it. Because once it gets too high or too low, you can't put foundations anymore. But yeah, this just ended up being like a giant block, so I'm not sure <laughs> how I'm going to follow up on it. And then my random staircase to build it. And then, yeah, just <clears throat> started building like another smelting room here so I could get some a few different things like extractors and stuff out. So currently my, my best looking part is just my original base. But yeah guys, so that was just the uh, how-to video on how to build a bridge. Um, you know, Be sure to like and subscribe and follow me for more content. I stream on Twitch and um, also on just on YouTube. And you guys have a great day.